Within the past few years, what I've done to prepare myself to play lead this year is besides all the classes and the lessons and workshops that I've taken, is I don't only listen to my mentors, but I watch what they do and learn from the examples that they set and I observe every move they make and learn from that as well. Over the past four years, how have you benefited from the theater program? You know, um, how have I not benefited from the theater program? Um, I started out just auditioning for the play freshman year, just as a fun thing to meet new people and to try something new in my life. And uh, here I am four years later auditioning for musical theater degree programs at some really uh, competitive schools um, all over the country in Oklahoma City, New York, Boston. Um, so I guess the most brief answer I can give you is that it's really uh, opened a lot of doors for me. Um, you know, it's taken me so many places this summer. I spent three weeks in Oklahoma City putting on a show uh, and learning at, at Oklahoma City University. And last summer I spent four weeks in Philadelphia at University of the Arts. So it's really just um, enhanced my life enormously. What obstacles or challenges have you faced while being a lead this year? Um, I've definitely faced a lot of uh, obstacles this year that I haven't in the past. Um, a lot of people come up to me and they say, Oh, I saw you in the show, you were that really funny guy. And it's been like that for a while, but this year, um, my character is sort of different, a little more dramatic, and I think people are a little bit confused because they've only known me as the funny guy in the show. So, it's not only trying to work for myself to become a better actor and sort of get in touch with that darker side but also to portray that message to the audience and get them not to see me as the weird funny guy anymore. 